Now go and get Adam to partake. tree. It is delicious to the taste and very desirable. Eve, do you know what fruit that is? Yes. It is the fruit of the tree of knowledge of good and evil. I cannot partake of it. Do you not know that Father commanded us not to partake of the fruit of that tree? Do you intend to obey all of Father's commandments? Yes, all of them. Do you not remember that Father commanded us to multiply and replenish the earth? I have partaken of this fruit and by so doing shall be cast out, and you will be left a lone man in the Garden of Eden. Eve, I see that this must be. I will partake that man may be. That is right. It is better for us to pass through sorrow that we may know the good from the evil. I know thee now. Thou art Lucifer, he who is cast out of Father's presence for rebellion. Yes. You are beginning to see already. What is that apron you have on? It is an emblem of my power and priesthoods. I am looking for Father to come down to give us further instructions. Oh, you are looking for Father to come down, are you? Jehovah, we promised Adam and Eve that we would visit them and give them further instructions. Come, let us go down. We will go down, Elohim. I hear their voices. They are coming. See, you are naked. Take some fig leaves and make you aprons. Father will see your nakedness. Quick, hide. Come, let us hide. Brethren and sisters, put on your aprons. I heard thy voice and hid myself because I was naked. Who told thee that thou wast naked? Hast thou partaken of the fruit of the tree of knowledge of good and evil of which we commanded thee not to partake? The woman thou gavest me and commanded that she should remain with me, she gave me of the fruit of the tree and I did eat. Eve, what is this thou hast done? The serpent beguiled me and I did eat. Lucifer, What hast thou been doing here? I have been doing that which has been done in other worlds. What is that? I have been giving some of the fruit of the tree of knowledge of good and evil.